hi y'all welcome back to my channel um so it's been a hot minute i was supposed to put something up last week or at least i was trying to but my kids ended up getting sick and then now i think i'm coming down with something i hope not but um so i just decided why not let's do the how i did my makeup in high school so if you're interested keep on watching <laughs> okay so in high school I did not do of course everything I've done today in makeup rules it was pretty simple pretty quick I usually 99% of the time if I did wear makeup I put it on in the car before getting to school because I did not feel like getting up earlier to put my face on. I know I'm really bad. So since we didn't have any primers or whatever back then, I just jumped into it. And before we had makeup sponges, I used these. Why? I don't know. I just did. <laughs> God help us. So we're going to do the cover girl in classic ivory. Now, when I was in high school, cover girl looked way different than this. So I'm hoping it's the right one. It, it probably is. I mean, it's a lot darker than what I did have in high school. So... So, just load her up all on my face. Gotta make sure you get all the red. Cover that up. Gotta get the nose. <laughs> so, I don't know why and how I didn't get makeup wedges. I forgot, honestly. I did sometimes have it in the car, but most of the time I just use my God-given brushes and sponges, you know, my fingers. And just rub that all in. So, luckily, oh my god, what was I going with that? I don't know. But this is so gross. Like, I honestly just want to wash my fingers, wash this off my face. Yeah, I got my lips too, you know, because, oh my god. I wanted that pasty, I'm dead look. So, I'm shockingly, this is close to my color, but except when I was in high school, the girl was lighter, so she really had that no color to her face look. None. And I would always try to get lighter so my red would cover didn't work like that all the time because my face still came out red so either it looked like I was crying 24 7 or I just ran a damn marathon and honestly everybody was like oh my god like are you okay like, yeah no yeah I'm fine it's just me <laughs> so I'm I'm cool it's the color of my face wow actually didn't blend out that bad <laughs> look at that makeup so gotta get it all down the neck <laughs> so gross 
So then, we barely use a concealer, except for under eyes. Barely got blemishes. But today, I got some, so I'm using it. And this is the CoverGirl in Fair Claire. So hopefully, this wants to work. Dab a little. And also, okay, so here's here's what happened. I uploaded this video yesterday. Got it all done, nice and perfect and funny. And then what do I do? Yes. I deleted the whole video. All of it. All of it gone. So now I'm just doing this just to whatever. I was so upset. Like, ugh. I was I was mad at myself last night. So I had to kick myself a little, but we're back. We're trying this again. Hopefully this doesn't get deleted and you're watching this at home. So that was pretty much all. So I know it's not gonna be as funny or whatever. I can't remember the stories I talked about yesterday. You girls old. No, hopefully we'll we'll get there slowly but surely. So then I use powder. And this is the 525 Buff Beige. And again, didn't have brushes, so. Yeah, you know it, I just took it. And I just powdered my face. Like it was no tomorrow. Like, when I wanted to cover this red, I wanted to cover the red. So, you're about to see, well, you can see <laughs> as a pasty girl. But this is what I did. Because if I didn't do this, I went to school barefaced. So, this is it. Also in high school, this was pretty much how I did my hair. It was either this look or up in a bun, which I'll have to somehow remember how I put the pictures up so you can see. So it's pretty much the same. Of course, God, what, 13 years later? graduated 2006 so yeah 13 years ago holy moly this was so 13 years ago and two kids later it's me so after that depending upon the mood I wanted I was either going to do pink blush to where you can't even tell or add a little color. In fact, I think this is the original blush I had in high school because <laughs> the package isn't or the back of it is on. I know it's um. Merle Norman, I think. I don't remember. But let's 
not good with this. Let's 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 try both. So handy dandy cover girl blush. Oh, and this is classic color for the natural glow. Alright, y'all. Getting that natural glow. Oh, this brush. Look at that. Not a fucking thing. But did I care? No, I bought this was the coolest blush on the planet. And I was popping with it. You know, like a G6. Clearly it looks like I have nothing on my face, so let's put a little of this. I mean, it's a pretty color. It was a pretty color. I don't know if it's probably changed colors over the years. I it's been a really long time. Sorry, blush. And for me to actually still have it after all this time. So this is somewhat better. Again, with my face, the red, it, it honestly, it just looked natural. And that was the look I was going for. Pale, pasty, and natural. And I think I achieved that. <laughs> And then a little on my nose and all over my face. And I'll go for the flash. Oh, my butt's asleep. Okay, so. High school. I didn't really do that much makeup until the end. Junior year, senior year was when I actually really started because I was raised by boys so your girl didn't know what to do with makeup and then her best friend came along beautiful beautiful thing now she did teach me a lot of things she didn't do any of this because only Jamie could achieve this look she was better but you know I thought I was the coolest bitch ever with this. <sighs> Thank God those those years are gone. So, ooh, scared them in the background. So now eyeshadow, Bramble, shockingly something that was not CoverGirl. This is actually not. The original, well, technically it's the original, but it's, I bought it again. It's the Walnut Pearls from Rimmel. So I just take my finger, get all up in there, and where's my mirror? <laughs> right here. And get it all over the lid. So, back to my best friend. She got me doing makeup or got me more into makeup, which the funny thing now is she doesn't do anything crazy like she used to. If she wears any makeup, it's, you know, simple, classy, pretty. And me, however, it's like everything makeup. Like, tables have turned find that funny we we actually joke around with that but um yeah so mine is her all I did did I do the other one wow I think I did <laughs> so mine is her I would just hang out with the boys so like she was one of the only ones that was a girl I hung out with the rest were boys and when I was with the boys, 
I didn't feel the need to put my face on. Unless, you know, I was in a random mood. So I was pretty much just bare skinned the whole time. So when I did, it was supposed to be amazing look I came up with. I thought it was again the coolest. Now looking back, I don't know. I mean I guess you could count this as a natural look if you add some color to your face and not be so pasty. But yeah, didn't, thank God, thank God I didn't go too crazy because oh boy, this video would have went into a different direction. So, did not, don't want that. <laughs> This would take me, maybe, let's see, it took me, depending upon traffic, 15 to 20 minutes to get to school. So, in about 10 minutes, I was usually able to achieve this look. But don't worry, you can too. So, after that, went to eyeliner. So, depending upon the mood again going through a phase high school weird times weird times I would either do brown like this or black but today we're gonna do brown because why not do is that a bug oh so why not do a more natural look right so I figured why not don't want to get too crazy and so the reason why I love this, number one, I love the name Espresso. It's adorable. And boom, lived off of this in high school. Anytime I did eyeliner, but I didn't like the look, smudge it, boom, that was it. Quick, in a hurry. Did not have to worry about getting it perfect. Oop, see, like that. I messed it up a bit, but here. Here's where the magic comes in, right? You see, it's all messed up, right? Not for long. That might have if I take it off. And you smudge it. Smudge, smudge, smudge. And boom. It's a lot better. And so another reason why I liked the smudger is because I have hooded eyes. So whenever I would put this eyeliner on, since it wasn't the pencil and I would open my eyes like this and then I close it and then you'd see that line and I hated, hated that with a passion. So, that's when I'm like, you know what, I'll just smudge it and it won't be as bad. So, I wouldn't worry. So, I wasn't, I didn't do the whole wings. I didn't do all the crazy cat eyes. Like, honestly, half of the time, or most of the time, I didn't even put eyeliner on the top of my lid. I just put it on the bottom. Yeah, the bottom lid. On the water. I'm sorry, the water. So when I did decide to put on top, it was the smudge. And it's not even. You see, that happened then too. <laughs> oh, text messages. love being a grown-up so 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 much fun and dolls I pretty much love it like that 
honest to God, like, I didn't even care. The messier, the better. <laughs> so then, this is, it actually grosses my husband out when I do this, and that's why I like doing it. So, pull this down, and look. I make sure to get all up in there. Especially with that black, I mean, I went to town on that. The darker the waterline, the happier I was. Again, it was a weird time in my life. We all go through that phase. Don't judge me. <laughs> ah. So, getting this done. You know, like, high school... I miss it. It was honestly one of the best times in my life. I had amazing friends. The school, eh, it was okay. We did have teachers that loved us. We had teachers that hated us. But, you know, that's everywhere you go. And looking back now, oh my god. I'm surprised I was not in jail or dead. Like, we did some stupid, stupid, stupid shit. Sorry, I got you. Especially hanging with all boys. I was like the mom of the group. So I made sure that, you know, they didn't wind up dead or in jail. Honestly, I should have just let their asses go to jail. So, the good girl in me. <laughs> and oh my god so our school was super small it was three trailers put together so I remember you could open up one side of the school and then the other side and you could see straight through the school yeah it wasn't a legit building Next up, these bad boys. My torture chambers, my children like to call. And I would just curl them up. Oops. And occasionally poke my eye out. It wouldn't be high school if I didn't, you know what I mean? So I did that. This one's not a curly. So I go over again, and this was pretty much, you know, every morning. I'm gonna get a Q-tip. And then that happens too, which, oh, you're about to see the fun, because it's gonna get messy. Just take a Q-tip. So. Then I would take good old handy dandy cover girl lash blast. I want to say I had the green one. I don't know if they still make the green one. But that one, oh, that one was really good. That was like my go to ride or die mascara. Like, oh, that was my love. And I would just load up. Because, see, we didn't have false lashes. We didn't have lash extensions, you know, came from a very small school, maybe 150 of us, so I mean, like, we didn't have anything too crazy. We were just relying on the good old layering up of mascara. Do a mascara face, because you can't put on mascara without doing mascara face. You look. I told you it gets messy by this. I don't know, it's just the CoverGirl mascaras. It's always done that. I could put on any other mascara. Does not do it. But this, yeah. But don't worry, there's a fix for that. I got the magic. I 
do that. And then what else do I do? Went back down into it. Right? I try to layer. I mean, I remember before I stopped, I would put like four layers of this on. Four. Now, that of course is unnecessary amount. But you know, for the sake of the video, Let's go for it. So, kind of in my foot. You can see I'm sitting on the bathroom floor. And like, look. Okay, so now you know we're getting somewhere. Okay, that's a good sign. Layer number three. So, the clumpier, the better. I used to say. That's when you know you were a real winner. And then of course, when this all dries, we're gonna wipe away last and final layer. So if you look up and if you can't see mascara, or if you're not super clumpy, you did it wrong. Sorry about that. Had a little take a break. Baby had a potty. So now that I've done that layer, it's as dry as it's gonna get. You see all this? It's gonna go bye bye. So it's better to wait when it dries because I learned when I removed it when it was wet. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Worst. Thing I could do because it's smeared and when it's smeared I look like a raccoon and as much as I love those little buggers not looking like a raccoon so do that that one's being difficult and of course, when it did take off some of the makeup, what did I do? I layered up some more. Got out the good old compact. And it won't open. And went to town. And so, before I put, no, I'm gonna do my lips, let them dry, and then I'm gonna show you some pictures of high school of what I did. I'm gonna put it somewhere in here. And now since your girl where is it? Oh no. <laughs> I found it. So put on any chapstick. Let's load her up. And since you're gonna ratchet, oh, I just ruined it. Oh, fantastic. This is the original. I don't know what it's called anymore. I wanna say it's the CoverGirl Atlas. At Atlas. In 205, like I just, I kept the lips simple. Shocking that I still have this because this was purchased like 0506 and we're not in 0506 anymore. So we'll see how this, um, if this still works. Basically, I put this on, let it dry like 30 seconds, let it get all sticky. That's when I knew it was dry. Then I put this on.
So, looking back now, I kept this look natural, minus my eyes. Because I wanted my eyes to shine like diamonds in the sky. You know what I mean? And this is the only way I knew how. Shockingly, for a 13 year old lipstick, it's not as bad. I wouldn't recommend doing it, so. So while that dries, I'm gonna put up a couple pictures, <laughs> like right there. And again, we literally have one more thing to do, and then that was it, thank God this abomination train is over with. So now it's time to make faces. So, oh, my foot's asleep. Now that it feels super gross, sticky, and clumpy, let's, you know, add step two. Boom. That's it. Oh god, this tastes grass. Now, the very last thing I did before stepping out the house. And yes. Got to get that water line popping. So let's load her up. I made sure every Part of my waterline was either black or brown. 99% of it was always black. But didn't want to go down emo lane today. Oh, this slips off is so gross. Oh, I need to throw that out. And that's it. This is your high school 2005-2006 Jamie look. And oh wait, I forgot. I stood my hair like this. How to do it like this. And then that's it. Okay, so the last thing to make this high school official, okay? Gotta do the duck face and the peace sign. So, thank you so much for watching. If you like this, comment, subscribe, like it. If you have any ideas on what I should do for my next video, just send a comment below. And thank you for coming down memory lane. Hopefully, this gets put up and not deleted. Your girl is still trying to figure this out because YouTube was way different from when. Did I have a YouTube in high school? No, that came after high school. Like 2007 was when I had YouTube. So you girls still figuring this out. Well, thank you so much and bye.